So I got the streaming version of the GCX event to work. And I just wanted to share uh, this version. So. Um, I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. Uh, this is slightly better than the desktop version. I mean, at least I can move around and tell what's happening. But it's extremely jarring. Um, so at least it's slightly better. But this is still uh, just outrageous <laughs> for spending, you know. Like if someone were to have bought a normal ticket for around $55, then this would be... I, it would still be horrible. I mean, what... There's small booths just around the place, and half of the pictures and, like, images that they have around here are all marketing. So there's a coffee company, a company that's owned by the same people who hosted this event. More coffee. <laughs> coffee. There's the coffee. I guess it's their coffee stand, yeah. It's just like yeah it's uh and then there's some ads for lg you know but it's hard to criticize because it's for a charity but i know for a fact that not all the money i spent went to the charity um so all for the i'm all for the reason behind the event but the execution is this is horrible <laughs> And then there's a in-game shop, yes, microtransactions, in this, where you can spend money to get t-shirts. If, if all this money goes to St. Jude's, then that's totally fine. But if, if like, any of this is being pocketed, it's just more of a joke. So... Yeah. It's... I'd like to explore and, like, go around here, but... It's basically unplayable, even at this state. Maybe... I could try to get some of the Easter eggs, but... Yeah. I guess this person's having the same issue I am. Just walk around a little bit more. The main, I guess it, the, the animation must happen when I talk. <clears throat> the main loop of this of this area, I don't know what they call it. That's where all the the booths are. So if I go to the map, you can see it's actually really small. Everything's in this loop. And I believe these are spawning places where everyone spawns in. But. Uh, of course, the panels that they did have today already ended before the, the launcher even went live. <laughs> so they just streamed them on Twitch. And I guess this is where they would be streamed in game, if I had to assume. So no one got to see the panels in the game. There's two or three more days left of the event. So, yeah. Become a partner today. Was this an in-game merch store? Like I, I can buy merch through the launcher instead of through their website. Yes, it is. <laughs> awesome. I'm glad they have that. In case I ever wanted to buy a shirt, I can just do it through this. very helpful can I interact with these 
Maybe. Huh. See, in the promotional material, they showed you... I think they showed a clip of someone playing games on this. Yeah. Does air hockey work? I mean, at least th that's got to work, right? I honestly sort of feel bad for the uh, managers of the event, because from what I can tell, it, it wasn't the manager's fault. <clears throat> It was the, uh, I have a feeling it was the development team, but it's, it's really hard to judge, you know, not knowing anything. There were some, uh, some sideways blows through Twitter. I saw some tweets from the GCX account, and, uh, they sounded sort of pointed <laughs> towards the development team, so... All signs of a of a good event. Uh, okay. The actual space doesn't look too bad, but the way they hyped it up. Like, this is not at all what, uh, oh, here we go. This is not at all what they said it would be like. Jesus Christ. I like the uh, the fan art that's been put up. Here's a uh, can't remember his name, Moniscus, something like that. Yeah, which is pretty good, pretty good art. But yep, right there, Moncus, Mon, Mon, yeah. You get it. <clears throat> See, this looks pretty good. I mean, all things considered. If it wasn't, you know, streamed at 720p and at four frames per second. But that, that looks cool. You can just sort of stand here and appreciate it. And as you can also tell, none of the usernames are working for anyone. So everyone's just named anonymous. There's people in the chat complaining about it running at 30 frames per second for them. What booths are there? There's the GXP. I believe that's the... Jesus Christ. That's the team who actually created this client so GCX or turbo play that must be the streaming client Never mind, that looks like something else I have no idea. Gilgamesh that might be the streaming client that they use to stream the game so I guess they uh, they all got their plugs in there's a Logitech booth nice 
Nice. Nerd and Needle. Awesome. We'll link to their website. And it seems like it crashed. Yep. Okay. Well, I'm sure you've seen plenty.